Hey, Room here, and today I would like to welcome you back to Seiyu Review, where I tell you facts about Love Live Seiyus that you probably didn't know about. And to be honest, I'm actually having fun recording these kind of original videos. So expect a lot more in the next days. All of these facts and information are all based in the Love Live Wiki. Link will be in the description if you want to check it out. Before we get into the topic today, I would like to say that the like and subscribe button is literally free to click. So I suggest not to waste this opportunity and make sure to click the bell to remind you that I recently posted a disappointing video. Before I start discussing about this seiyuu, I would like to show you something that will make you squeal. And trust me, you'll really do. Yes, it's the seiyuu that is an embodiment of an author. It's Suwa Nanaka. I'll give you 3 seconds to look at this comparison of Suwa and an author. I'll bet you a million bucks if that isn't accurate enough. Suwa Nanaka is the seiyuu of Kanan Matsura, a third year in the idol group of Aquarius, and her call out is like this. I won't really show more since it can be a spoiler in the anime. She was born on November 2, 1994, and she is currently 25 today. Her origin is in the Saitama Prefecture. She started her seiyuu training when she was in her second year of high school. And here's the part where we should appreciate her so much. She goes all the way from Saitama to Tokyo every Saturday to take her classes. No wonder why she's really good at voice acting. And I got to say, her hard years of Seiyuu Academy really paid off. Now, this is the part where we can really relate with Suwa's personality. Apparently, she loves sleeping. Yes, an idol sleeping all the time. Whenever she has free time, she just sleeps. That's why you'll always see her eternally asleep all the time. Just like us in quarantine today, she watches anime and movies, and of course, she loves to play games. Just like Kanan, she loves to hug other Aquarius members. It's really, really, really cute and wholesome. Her special talents is playing the piano, calligraphy, and most importantly, her English skills. Another thing about Sua is her school idol festival skills. There are certain videos and live streams showing her talent in YouTube that shows her tapping skills when it comes to the game. And I got to say, she's really she's really really better than me. So what do I think about Sua? She's one of the most cutest seiyuu I've seen yet. She makes these adorable sounds when she wants to get an attention, just like an author. That's why I always compare her to it. During her years being part of Aquarius, her singing improved. People used to dislike her voice for some reasons, but in my opinion, it's really, really cute. I'll rate this seiyuu at 11 out of 10. 5 out of 5 cuteness, 5 out of 5 seiyuu skills, and most importantly, 6 out of 5 being the most wholesome seiyuu out there. And that's another episode of Say Review. That's already the second episode. And I would like to upload more this week. And before we end the video, I would like to thank Thirsty Lemon for helping me out today. If you want to see hilarious Love Live moments and Geometry Dash gameplay, then I suggest checking him out. Link will be in the description, guys.